Hello and welcome to Sinekari Movie Reviews. I'm Shikha Bhatnagar and I'm going to review the much-awaited Kanchi. This film marks the return of Subhash Gai as the director. It also features Karthik Tiwari and Vyukama Mishti. We also get to see Rishi Kapoor and Mithun Chakravarti in pivotal roles. So let's find out how did this do. Kanchi is a story of the inner power of a woman who represents millions of suppressed youth against injustice in the country. It is also the story of an innocent rural beauty and her fight against power. To know what happens to Kanchi, you'll have to watch the full movie. For me, only two things worked. Firstly, the location was beautiful. The art department did a great job of designing the set. Secondly, the main idea behind making this film, which is a rural girl fighting against power, was a nice one. There are many things that did not work for me. Firstly, is the action sequences. They were very unrealistic. There was a scene where the villain throws Kanchi on a track full of stones. She falls flat on her face and yet she gets up without a scratch. Secondly, the film is so messed up and so long that you start wondering why are you even there. Thirdly, Mishti as a character that she portrays in this film definitely did not work for me. I don't think it's going to open any doors for her. And lastly, the music, of course, most of the songs were disastrous and torturous and they were really out of place. Subhash Ghai's films are known for its sense of music, but sadly, even that didn't work. He definitely had a great vision, but he failed to deliver it. I give Kachi 1 out of 5 stars. So guys, this is all I have for you today. To save others from the depression I went through, share this movie review. I saved your money and time. In return, please subscribe to Sinekari for all the latest short films, celebrity gossips and movie reviews.